this is old Total Warrior. Welcome to my new Rome Total War campaign where I will be playing as the Scipii. Scipii is the last of the Roman factions. I played the Brutii, the Julii, and even the Senate. Now it's time to play as the Scipii. And I want to do things a little different uh, from the way I have before. So if you've watched my Scipii strategy video, I'm not going to exactly do that. I'm going to do something else. We're a Roman faction, so we have a mission from the Senate, and that is to take Syracuse, which is on the island of Sicily, right there. Let's take a look at our faction, see what we have. We start with two cities. We have the usual two agents. And we have four generals, and I'll say a mediocre lot of generals. And the faction leader is 54 years old, and he has an aged retainer. And some other attributes. There's a Greek diplomat, he's sort of in the way. Your honor. But we'll manage. He'll be useful later. I spy down to here and take a look into Syracuse where they have a factionaire, a couple hoplites, a couple militia hoplites, archers, and peltasts. I'm not going to put him in the city Searching and spy on the diplomat and maybe get some training. Didn't work. Moving. You can go that way. Out of moves, sir. Sometimes General. even at 100% you'll get a... General. A slight increase as a spy. I want to take this general now and I have to be careful because I want to move him around Leaving the army. to Under. here March. and attack. attack. Settlement, sir. The ladder which he won't be climbing. Settlement under siege, sir. This we're at war. Sir. And I'll bring up the rest of the army. Forward. Imperator. A couple mercenaries available, but I don't think I'll need them. Here. Sir. Take this general and this unit, and this general, general. and Sir. these units. March. And they're going to head around to Apollonia. Set sail! Out of move, sir! Sir. Going to take our diplomat, we're going to move him north. Your honor. He's going to go up and talk move. to the Gauls. here. I'm going to build a port here. And here I'm going to start working on uh, stables. And let's go to the second turn. Because that didn't take very long. Alright, the uh, Greeks have sallied out. We know what they have. It says so this battle shouldn't be much of a problem. We want to sally out battle because that's much easier than uh, fighting a siege. Also did not want to take Syracuse until the second turn because there's a diplomatic difference. Previously in campaigns years ago Sometimes you get the spy in the Syracuse and you can attack Syracuse Guys, in the first turn. That's not a bad thing. Here. Send them to fight. Dishearten the enemy. Except that the Greek diplomat, when he did that, would not uh, offer a ceasefire. When I wait until the second turn, the Greek diplomat does offer a ceasefire. We'll get these guys up here the hill because we want the Greek army to come up marching after them. Speed this up. And so we want them to be nice and tired. The 
time they get to our army. coming out of the city. are firing. The enemy Our general is dead. slain, and now his men that fear us. Excellent. It is time to press the attack. Look like they're heading back. Good afternoon. guys. expect those hoplites to get back so quickly. They're not quickly enough. This is a heroic victory! Worth okay, so we end up with four arms. casualties. Not bad. Killing off that general changed my plan since with the general died, everybody ran back to the town square and then you get the hall place marching up this all the way up rolling. the hill and uh, being killed by my pila and arrows and javelins as I expected. Okay, we're going to enslave Syracuse. Distribute half the population. We got some money and they want us to take Lilybaum and we'll get a Triari for that. Yeah, we got 5,000 Inari.
Okay, what if Scipio is better recruiting and we've dragged our Roman buddies into war? What are friends for? Noble master? That gold diplomat is Honor. around here somewhere. At once. Without delay. We'll find him on the next turn. Fleet ready. Aye, aye, Captain. Headed for Apollonia. Okay. Your Honor. Now our spy here can see family member and skirmishers. Spying. And a Carthaginian army on ships. We want that army to stay on those ships. So what we're going to do General. is move this army over, but not into Carthaginian territory. Onward! Out of move, sir. Here. Recruiting and building a shrine, and that will be just fine. Oh, interesting. Well, that's why I don't recruit that. Okay. Capua. Recruit another Stadium Sano. We won't recruit another peasant, I don't think. Actually, might be useful. And we're building or recruiting everywhere. Let's do a save game. So it's the end of turn two. Let's move on to turn three. Greeks are now offering a ceasefire, and we will make a counteroffer, which is that we want money, and we want almost 14,000. They accept it. You ask for 14,000, they, they'll agree, but they'll want to pay it over five turns. And I want to get my money now. So I take one denarii less in order to get everything I want. Okay. Now we notice that the uh, ship has sailed off somewhere. Set up this army for an attack. What is this? Regular, just a regular general. So we come up here. Leaving the army. March. And put him Imperator. up at this corner. March. Attack. He'll make the actual attack. Besieging settlement, sir. Okay. There's no gain in waiting because they're not going to sally out anyway now that I think about it. So I actually, you know, this whole sally thing was not necessary. So let's just fight the battle. It's a good thing that spy worked because I would have. Uh, not have had an adequate siege. 
I forgot about that. That army is too small. They're, they're not going to sally out against a, a general, just a general unit. I don't think. Today we face the mighty Carthaginians, brave men and worthy foes. All right. Reinforcements have arrived, but are they in time to take part in the battle? This is triple speed them up here. I'd run them, but that will exhaust them, and I don't want that. So I'll just have to wait a minute. And the more I move the screen or anything like that, that just slows down things. Turn a little bit. are warmed up, they'll be okay. Still want to get wounded. Because then I'll have to take time to arrest them. General. Our soldiers have captured the walls! Now is the time to press on and capture this place! What I want to try to do... are working.
enemy army is in okay rome demands victory from her generals and this day is clearly our victory it's lost a lot of the study not surprising Let me think. We're at war. All well, those people went in Syracuse, but that's Actually, only half of them go to Syracuse, the other half would go to Rome. The Roman faction. Fleet ready. Now, I'm going to bring this ship to here. Aye, aye, Captain. Get my army off. General. The ship. Orders. Onward. Can recruit mercenaries, but I don't need them. Prepare for battle. And we're going to take Apollonia. And our allies, the Brutia, are going to help. In fact, they're going to help so much. I'm going to let them do all the fighting. And we'll just sit and watch. The seer has been consulted, but his vision is clouded. Today well, maybe we should get him some glasses. Because we're pretty, pretty dominant in this situation. They'll, they'll have a unit over here. Or something, peasants. I'm not going to be much concerned about them. They're coming out after us. Oh, the Rudy are taking the town square. You guys are losing your city. The enemy general flees. The enemy show yeah, their true watch virtue. Them get slaughtered here. They are not soldiers. Only the Rudy, I can actually rabbit. get some more experience. Rome demands victory from there. All right. Settlement captured. And we'll just occupy this place. I captain. There's a large fleet. It's a random event in Kurt that it, uh, is bad because I want to put these ships 
on this side of the Italian peninsula to shuttle reinforcements here up to, over to Greece. Attack, they'll attack both of us together and we'll be able to defend the walls and we'll create a peasant. And finally, can I be of service? There's the Greek, there's the diplomat. I'll do a quick save because I'm going to do a dipl diplomatic thing here and I have to I do it just right. Once. This is really nasty. It's an exploit. I didn't invent this. But I did see it in someone else's video who didn't invent it, so it actually originated by some third party. We make another offer. This time we demand three settlements. They, they want money. Of course we say no. And so we revise this to four settlements. Again, they want money. And we make another proposal where we ask for all their regions except the capital, which isn't listed here, that's Alicia. Say so we want all your cities. And they say 10,000 for 17 terms. We agree. And of course, we actually haven't. That's interesting. Yes. I actually haven't given them any money yet. At once. Out of I'm not going to. Because. attack them with uh, I'll use a peasant from here we lose now we're at war and I'm not going to pay them any money and I just picked up six towns like I said this is this is an exploit of the software and you know if you frown on it that's fine I just wanted to show it. And I have mixed feelings, actually, as to how good an idea it is. Because, because in previous runs, I found that it can be a bit of a distraction uh, if you end up spending a lot of time and effort trying to hold on to all of those cities because they're scattered and not strongly garrisoned. With that practice range there because I want to get archers as quickly as possible in Mantia, I'm not happy. Have and we'll build a shrine to Saturn. And okay, they're as happy as they can be. We need to go around and uh, do 
some thinking. Now I've got a Gallic army here. I'm probably not going to attack. I'll almost certainly lose that place very quickly, so there's no point in trying to maintain a garrison there. And the same here. So I'm going to move people out of there. Because that's, that's a lot of Gauls, I can't defend that. We'll get rid of that unit. Save this port. Portal come in handy, especially if I have to deal with pirates right away. Crew town watch. How about this place? What's the income difference? About a hundred. try to build anything in any of these three places. I want to see what gets attacked. Here. I have to worry about, of all things, eight. Well, that's the Gauls. Okay, that's a Gaul. Sometimes the Spanish show up real quickly, but I'm guessing that's the next turn. So we're good there. What do we want to construct here? Barracks. Really bound. Gonna go with land. That actually has a very high population growth. So I, I'm going to go with uh, Militia Barracks. Gaudi Redonum, nothing. Lamonum, nothing. Mediolanium, done, done. Arvo Martius, nothing. And make sure I have units being recruited where I want. Nothing there. Training. It's probably a temple. Upgrades of missile weapons will definitely do that. They, they might get attacked right away. I'll we'll try to hold them since I do have some units there. The sound is good. turn three and that will end this video. Thanks for watching. Post any questions or comments on YouTube.